My name is Ashley Gordon. I'm part of the radio, television, and arts community here at Delta College. Adriana Broger is a professor here who's worked in the industry, who saw just a little inkling in me and took it, snatched it, and honed in on it. So when I came to Delta College, I knew I wanted to be in the news. I just wasn't sure exactly how to get there and what that actually looked like. But when I came into those doors, I was met by um, Professor Broger. So I asked her, how do I go about getting into the news? And she showed me step by step. You need to learn how to do packages. You need to learn how to edit. You need to learn how to speak and communicate effectively. So people who are going to be successful at this really have to have determination, tenacity, and the passion to go for it. Ashley definitely has all of that. And then she took me through those steps. And then when she thought I was ready, she said, hey, there's an internship available at Fox 40. I think it's something you're going to excel at. So I used my personal network of people that I know in newsrooms in Sacramento. And I reached out and said, hey, I have a student at Delta College. I think she's really sharp, and she would be a valuable asset to your team here. And she took it from there. I went in there for the interview and I crushed it. And I got it. <laughs> I worked my way up to um, assistant segment producer. So I was producing the 8 a.m. hour and 9 a.m. hour. Every morning, you got to see something that I put together if you were watching Fox 40. And that led to a job. And that's very exciting that our Delta College students are getting placed in top 20 markets here in the United States. Our students at Delta College are here on so many different paths. Some people are here to go to the four years, some people are here to earn a certificate, and then we have students who are ready for a job right after taking a few classes. My hope for radio television students is that they not only acquire the technical skills needed, that they know how to operate a camera and audiovisual equipment, that they understand editing, but that aside from that, they also work well with others, that they feel comfortable, that they have improved communication skills and feel like they can go out into the workforce and communicate effectively. So much can happen, you know, and I believe in the idea that the power of yet, as Broger would say, right? Broger always says, the power of yet. You may not be good at something yet. You may not be where you want to be yet, but that always leaves room for more. That always leaves room for it to come to you. So I wanted to be in the news, and I got in the news. <laughs> she showed me how to do it.